What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new video and in this tutorial guys, I'm going to show you guys how to create an awesome energy ball effect. So I would say make sure to smash the like button down below already and I would say let's get started. So as you can see right now, this is of me, uh, a clip of mine, uh, pretending that I'm holding uh, the energy ball. So that's going to be a really simple, you just want to go ahead and pretend that you're, that you're uh, holding this energy ball obviously and then uh, you need an energy ball itself. So what I'm going to do... Is I'm going to go to an, uh, my folder and I'm going to drag in an energy ball I found on YouTube. I'll leave the download link uh, in the description. You guys can download it and use it yourself. So this is the energy ball that we're going to use. So I'm going to go ahead and make a new video track. And I'm going to drag it on top of the clip where I'm standing with that ball. So in order to um, remove the black background, what we're going to do is we're not going to put this one to uh, the compositing mode to screen. Because as you can see, the ball becomes like really light. What we're going to do is we're going to apply... A a chroma key on top of it so change it back to source alpha what we're gonna do is we're gonna add in a little bit of brightness and contrast to it because I, I think it has to stand out a little bit more so I'm gonna go to videos I'm gonna drag it on and that makes a huge difference now what we're gonna do the next thing is to go to video effects and we're gonna pick the chroma key right here and we're gonna drag it on top of the energy ball we're gonna go ahead and uncheck it for a second then we're gonna just pick this pencil choose a black color reactivate it again and as you can see there is the ball but we need to optimize those markers as you can see so that's going to be uh, pretty simple just you know mess around a little bit more until you're happy with it now what we're gonna do is we're gonna resize this ball so we're gonna go to the track motion icon then we're going to shrink this down until it fits in my hands. So as you can see, if I play back the video, this is what it looks like. And obviously you can make this ball move a little uh, by just going to the uh, event pen crop of the energy ball. Then just, you know, click right here. Then just, you know, move it up a little. Uh, place a new keyframe right there. Move it a little bit down. A little bit keyframe like this. And obviously you can just do that for the whole ball. I'm just going to go ahead and do that real, real quick. Because for the sake of this video. So then if I play back this video and when I finish uh, using those keyframes... Um, I'm just hoping that the ball will actually move, you know, in quite some dif some directions. So I'm going to go ahead and, and replace it like this. So if you play back the video, as you can see, this is basically uh, me holding that ball. And it's moving a little bit. And that's so awesome it looks. So this is how you create an energy ball, guys. It is a pretty straightforward tutorial, I know. And it's probably really short as well. And this is how you manage to get an energy ball. So that's it. That's all I have for you guys today. Guys, currently I'm running a giveaway at 100 150,000 subscribers but at the point when I'm uploading this video it is going to be I think Thursday or Friday um, we are just a hundred a few hundred subscribers away from 150,000 so I'm so stoked to do this giveaway I'm gonna give away one copy of this program Vegas Pro 15 599 dollars I'm gonna give that away to one of you guys that really need it thing guys and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video just Alex Halford